Doom, doo, doo, doom, doo, doom, doom, doo, doom, it's Dumite's News Review. Hey, what up, y'all? What? What was that? <laughs> yep. You are not seeing things. This is my brand new e -cig. I got it just today, Saturday, May 17th, 2K14. Springtime, happy spring. I know I haven't really put out a video lately, but it's time to do another snooze review as the intro said no we're not going to be reviewing the e-cig just yet because like i said i just got it today uh only taking a couple of drags on it at the place where i got it that would be vape avenue here in amarillo but i'm not gonna like i said i'm not gonna go into depth and in, with my e-cig That'll have to wait until another video. Uh, I know y'all probably disappointed, but that's alright. Um, I hope to review, well, give you a proper review here in the near future. You know, after I get some puff time on it, drag time on it, whatever you want to call it, inhale time. <laughs> uh, suffice it to say that uh, it's a very interesting phenomenon, you say. Anyway. Like I said, it will be a snooze review this time around, and the snooze I will be reviewing is Old Ving 99 portions. Now, you might be wondering, Old Ving 99, what exactly does the 99 stand for? Well, I don't know why they called it 99, but the 99 stands for coffee, evidently. This is a coffee flavored snooze portions. Uh, I have to give them kudos on the can. The can rocks. Uh, if you'll notice on the on the snooze catcher lid, like the Merry Christmas snooze that I reviewed a while back on YouTube, the snooze catcher lid it actually is attached to the can, which rocks. Second of all, the design on the can. I mean, it's very cool, very classic. I should have played some my I should have played some Man of War on this review, but I didn't. Instead you're getting the Nax, My Sharona. This song kicks ass in a late seventies, early eighties wick. Um Yeah, just wait until the guitar kicks in, it rocks. Anyway, Old Bang 99. I've snoozed most of the can can already. And this is actually a good thing because you really need to well, hang on just a second. I'm going to go ahead and put one in for y'all real quick. Are you dig on this awesome guitar. Rocks and rocks. And here's a portion. The smell of this stuff will get you. At first, you probably won't like it too much. You probably won't think that the snooze itself is anything to write home about at first but in time as you enjoy the snooze and you will enjoy it you will find out that there is more of this snooze than first impressions okay I believe that's sufficiently fluffed so I'm gonna go ahead and put her in my lap guitar is kicking ass right now. <laughs> it rocks. But yeah, the good thing about this label is that it's really easy to line up. I mean, you got the barcode, and then you got the old bang, and it's all good. Anyway, like I said, the snooze takes a little bit of getting used to. Um, but once you do get used to it, that's not bad. I probably wouldn't get another can of it myself, but it's not bad. Uh, as most of y'all know, if y'all have seen my other videos, I do drink coffee, but then again, I'm very particular about my coffee. I grind my own beans. Uh, I say screw Starbucks, because their coffee is way overpriced, and I can get a pound and a half of beans at World Market whole beans for 10 bucks if you ever if you ever find yourself around a 
world market location by all means go in there it's a beautiful store anyway I digress um Old Vang 99 is it's coffee flavored it's not very strongly coffee flavored which is strike one against it because I like a strong coffee but it is coffee flavored um it is you know very interesting in flavor like I said it you know it takes a little while two portions for you to kind of get into the flavor so don't buy a can of this stuff and go on thinking that you're gonna love it at, you know at first portion because chances are you're not but give it a little while give it a chance to kind of win you over as it were and if it will not be your favorite portion favorite snooze it will at least show itself to be fairly decent I mean you know I'll, I'll give it that it's it's a pretty decent snooze um, I know I haven't really been <laughs> that kind to it but that's all right uh, by the way love is like oxygen by its sweet great great late 70s tune this happens to be the full version so it's got the the soft version, you know, the soft instrumental instrumental portion in, in the middle, but we probably won't get to that part in this video, sadly. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. Anyway, um, Old Bang 99, one more shot of the can, one more shot of the sign of the can. It's a decent snooze. Like I said, I probably won't get it again. Oh, by the way, this is snooze. Actually, there's another snooze that I got from Jagman SS. Thanks a lot, buddy. Appreciate it. Um, but, yeah. Old Vang 99 snooze. Not bad. I've actually got another flavor of Old Vang in my freezer waiting for me to review. I haven't tried it yet, so I can't give you a preview or anything like that, but I do have it in my freezer, and I will review it on here sooner or later. So, without further ado, Let's get to the fairly recent subscribers, or the, well, it's just subscribers that I have not mentioned yet on my videos. And shouted out yet on my videos. <laughs> okay, let's go. The new subscribers, or, well, subscribers in general, for this video are Elgin Smoke, Wolfgang HH, Jordan Bear 551, Connor Lawrence, K. Quinnen, X, OG Metalhead, 206 X. Hmm. Well, when you know, we did get into the soft instrumental portion of the song. Anyway, uh, Beast of the East 19, Redman Gold 12, Mr. Locatelli 21, and John Taylor. Those are my shout outs for this video. Uh, I will probably have another snooze video, snooze review before I get to reviewing the e-juice that is in my e-save right now. But, that's another story, like I said in the beginning of the video. So, for now, I will say that the Doom is out. Keep on dipping, snoozing, using smokeless tobacco, and vaping, since I'm no longer a vape virgin now, <laughs> in general. <laughs> See you later. Warning. This product can cause gum disease and tooth loss. But you already knew that, right? <laughs>